So the ten horns, some of in the ten horns is one head of the seven heads. So some people think the horns are not distributed in all the seven heads. It is in one single head. So the dictator who had authority over ten kingdoms representing ten horns in Daniel vision. So John's vision of ten crowns on ten horns. So these are something similar. Roman Empire will renew in some way, or it could be an European Empire. So we are not sure. It could be a political power. So that could be alliance of several countries. So who will, can economically dictate the world? Who can dictate the world by the military might? And maybe today because of the IT power. So each head advertises blasphemy against God. Satan is a blasphemer. The beast is a person having control over a global power. So the dragon gives his throne authority to that beast. So we have to understand, as father gave authority to son, dragon will give throne authority to Satan. So he will also imitate the father God by ordaining or having somebody empowered by him who will be the beast. So the beast takes the offer that Lord Jesus Christ refused. If you take the temptations of Lord Jesus Christ, Satan came and said, see the glory of the whole world, all kingdoms, all nations, bow down just before me once, that too in secret, I will keep you. Lord Jesus Christ refused. But the beast, the person who is going to be the person who will control the global government, would have already bowed down before the dragon and the dragon empowers him as Antichrist or alternative to Christ for the Gentiles or the people who refuse to believe Lord Jesus Christ. Satan himself would take possession of this man as he did Judas. So he will say, dragon will take complete possession of this beast. So thoughts, ideas, all his decisions will be by dragon who possesses him. So the image of beast is published and all are commanded to worship the beast. So it will be published. It can come into your smartphones. It, it can come in all apps. It can come in all the uh, social media, mass media. So it will, can come in all the advertisements. So identity of beast in Daniel is. So it is, Daniel images in this vision is used to communicate the identity of the beast. So the first three animals are lion, bear, the leopard, that is Babylonian empire, Persian empire, then the Greek empire. The fourth is the dreadful, indescribable beast representing most probably the Roman empire. So John presents the beast as the extension of the fourth beast. So the Roman Empire was very strong, very, very, uh, we can say, heavy-handed that could destroy any people who rise against them. The final world empire would be vigilant like the might and power of fear, ferociousness of lion. So they have all, all the characteristics. So totalitarian governments have these categories. Daniel gives the characteristics of the empire while the revelation shows the beast. So the beast will rule the empire. The empire is the beast. The beast is the empire. So the beast will be wounded. So maybe because of God's judgment. So the wound would be healed and he will become famous. So it is like enacting the resurrection. Lord Jesus Christ died on the cross of the Calvary was buried on the third day he was raised. Satan will imitate a similar thing. A wound will be there. Maybe the dragon himself can 
give the wound to the beast and also heal. So the world will believe and his power and popularity will increase, multiply, and he will be worshipped. So the beast will blast. His name is Tabernacle and Heaven. And he will be given authority for 42 months. That's what we see about the beast that came from the sea. So those who do not bow and worship will be persecuted. So those whose names are not written in the Lamb's book of life will be persecuted. It was similar to the first century. The church was persecuted. So the believers were asked to come and declare once a year in the temple dedicated to Caesar, saying Caesar is Lord to renew their citizenship. But Christians said Jesus is Lord. They refused to say Caesar is Lord. So they were persecuted. A similar thing will happen. So they will demand that we declare to retain our citizenship or privileges. So the believers are called to be steadfast in the faith. So then the third thing, that is dragon came, and uh, the first beast that goes from the sea, there will be a second beast, the third person rising from the land. This beast is coming out of here. Had two horns like a lamb, but spoke like a dragon. So this beast is of lesser rank as it points the beast, the first beast to be worshipped. So what is the work of this second beast who could be termed as false prophet or anti-spirit, anti-Holy Spirit? So this, as Holy Spirit glorifies the Son, this second beast will be a false prophet want to glorify the first beast so he will play like the role of false prophet, pointing people towards false Christ, that is Antichrist. So the two horns would represent authority over two realms, maybe politics and religion, or politics and economy. We are not sure what it means, but it could be anything. So the second beast as false prophet. So the speech is like dragon, that is, imitates Satan. The second beast is also called as false prophet. The dragon is anti-father, beast from the sea is anti-Christ, beast from the land is anti-Holy Spirit. The second beast exercises influence similar to that of first beast. Perform signs like bring fire from sky. So they are false prophets like Elijah did. So they will do. So though through signs, they deceive people. This beast has power to give breath to the image of the beast so that the image could speak. So we are talking about artificial intelligence, robots that can speak. So they will give breath to the image of the beast. So they can create the image of the first beast and the second beast will give the power to breathe and to speak. So the idolatrous image that could speak is what Daniel and Paul spoke about. The image will be placed in the rebuilt temple in Jerusalem. So when the temple is completed, the, that will be placed there. So what would be the economic strategy? All should be should receive the mark of the beast to buy or sell anything. Satan, the dragon, will not have his mark, but he will choose the first beast that came from sea as is like Christ, the express image of dragon will be the first beast that coming out of the sea. So that beast, Mark, is required. So Mark on the right hand or on the foreheads. So some people think the 666, there will be a microchip planter or they will put the tattoo. So all those things. So that need not so foreheads means mental concern. So any person who accepts dragon, the first beast, the second beast, their philosophies, their ideas, their teachings, their spiritual um, guidance, so they already have the seed. 
So it, it will not be a seed that could be need to be planted in the forehead or the right hand. Right hand means partnership, fellowship, collaboration. When people compromise with them, so they already have the seed. So it could be even a microchip or without microchip. We are not going to be dogmatic about it. If that is the case, even your own SIM card can be that. So you don't need anything else. So because we carry all the mobile phones every time. So that could be the very mark on the, that could be put on people. So anyway, so the whole idea is, do we mentally consent to the philosophies, the teachings, the spirituality that dragon, first beast, and second beast stand for? Do we have relationship or partnership with those ideas of dragon, first beast, and second beast? If so, we already have seen. So what we learn is, so Revelation 12 and 30 talks about a lot of important issues. So the, the fight in heaven, the dragon, which falls, and the emergence of first beings, the emergence of second beings. There is an idea about nation of Israel, the Lord Jesus Christ, then the persecution of saints, and then the last days, how the, the tribulation would be, and in the last we see. So Satan wants to own, the dragon wants to own his people, as Lord Jesus Christ has sealed his people. Yes, his people are sealed. We are sealed. Is there a visible mark? No, but we are sealed. We are sealed by the Holy Spirit. In the same way, Satan also wants to imitate, seal his own people with his own mark. So another way of interpreting 666 is all are incomplete. Seven is complete. Six is human nature. Six is human accomplishments. It is human ideas. So it is incomplete. So the best of human aspiration can be only 666. It can never be 777. Because seven is completeness, according to the scripture. Let us close our eyes and 